Hello, sports fan. This is Stephen here with Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the Las Vegas Raiders taking on the Kansas City Chiefs. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates each and every time we have breakdowns here at Sports Choice Plus. Without further ado, let's get right into the action. Looking at the Las Vegas Raiders, they're coming into this game, um, and they're not really confident right now. You know, coming in off of a loss, and you're looking at the way that they lost to Washington, it wasn't really an impressive game. Their offense stalled out. When you look at just what they were able to do, Yes, Mark Jacobs did run the football a little bit. They did have a couple of good throws from Derek Carr. But when you're looking at this defense, this defense cannot consistently stop somebody. When you're looking at yesterday, them a part of it was Washington shooting themselves in the foot and not really producing on offense. A part of it was this defense is just terrible. Uh, when you look at just overall in general, a couple of overthrows, a couple of drops, it, it was a number of things that went on that Washington did to stop themselves. So you can't really say that, you know, Washington didn't get the best out of what they did. But looking at this game here, Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs offense is not the same. They did beat the Broncos considerably without throwing that touchdown. Patrick Mahomes literally is 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 having an awkward phase right now where he's not really playing as himself. He's not really making the throws that we know he can make. He's forcing a lot of issues. He's trying to score on every single play. And I think that's hurting this offense. This offense is based, West Coast offense, based off heavy timing. Two things that you need in this offense, speed and consistency. Speed and consistency. What that does, that allows you to call plays, keep guys on the field, get the ball open to the receivers that need to get it, and they get in the space, they can move with that speed, and they're gone. Andy Reid's play caller, you can see the way he's trying to set the game up. They're not really having a run game. So Patrick Mahomes is having to get those third and eights. He's having to get those second and 11s. He's having to get those first downs for these guys. And, you know, it worked a little bit yesterday, but then it also come back to bite them. When he's careless with the football, it's, it's very hard to see this team do what it does best. The Chiefs defense deserves a lot of credit because it stepped up yesterday. Even though Teddy Bridgewater is not an elite quarterback, he has the, the weapons on that offense to get the job done. He has those weapons on the offense to possibly score points very quickly. And the Chiefs locked it down. They locked it down to where it wasn't an easy uh, 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 throw anywhere. It wasn't a lot of, of easy stuff as far as yak and things like that. So kudos to the Chiefs. So in this game here, you got to ask yourself, which team is going to bounce back and play normally like themselves right now? I'm leaning towards the Chiefs right now because I don't see the Raiders right now as a viable threat to do anything. Once they lost John Gruden, once they, once they lost Ruggs, it was just a, a, a reality that your season is coming crashing down. The, the show's over, feel-good story's over, and then boom, you have to face reality. In this game, I expect the Chiefs to have a similar day that they had the first time they played, and I think they're going to put a lot of points on the board. When you look at the the, the Raiders not having their best weapons, that affects this as well, and I think Patrick Mahomes is going to tee off on that defense. I thought that, you know, if he was having struggles now, he's going to really have a great game against the Raiders because they're not going to be covering people in press. They're not going to be able to stop people one-on-one. -on -one. So those Travis Kelsey matchups, those Tariq Hill uh, matchups, possibly going deep a lot more. You may see that. You may see a little bit more touch on these passes when he's going deep. So I'm picking the Kansas City Chiefs to win this one. No disrespect, Raiders. It's just not your game this week. I think that they want revenge. They want to make sure you understand that they are the team to beat in the AFC West. And as right now, Patrick Mahomes is looking to get his mojo back. So I feel like this is going to be a blowout game. Raiders, I'm sorry. Chiefs, get in the comment section. Tell me what you think. And as always, we thank you so very much. We'll see you on the next video. And uh, like, share, and subscribe on your YouTube channel.